Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you uh, Automapper class in um, ASP.NET Core. So first of all, uh, without Automapper, uh, I will share you my um, error uh, code or you can say error message. So I have a, a I category interface and that uh, interface implemented by a class and use a class also the category class in which we have id title parent id parent children and that class is called uh, uh, mapping with the other tables okay so this is the class category class now come to the section is interface and i have a repository class that is category repository and that category repository is inherited or implemented by i category interface that the curd uh, functionality create update get category get all category save updates etc okay now when you move uh, from uh, and you want to separation the mvc model that is mu model view and controller model is actually divided into the two parts that is the domain model and the um, yet yeah, uh, your view model so your con category controller only have a view model but you get from the model so always you get the error that is type of uh, conversion from model to view model there is the view model but uh, always compiler said that you need a model because you get item from the model so i have a category view that is the view model okay in category repository must to uh, listen must to careful to listen i have a get all category that method is retrieving the item from the model but here you can pass the view model in the item here you pass model but here you can use a view model so that's type of thing you need to map view model and the model so mapping is required it here and get uh, without any mappings you get always uh, this types of error message okay let's to have to check index create yeah that's type of message invalid operation exception the model type passed into the view data dictionary that type of uh, model dot category but you need to uh, but you have to use category view model pass model but you used view model so map these model each other how to use it so first of all you need to uh, add a package that is automapper package install dash package automapper into your uh, package manager console so open package manager console type in the um, pm install package package automapper yeah successfully loaded okay you can check it successfully loaded into your directory and after doing this must to uh, add a class that is auto map configuration as inherited with the profile class and in the constructor you can add a create map so add a folder that is auto mapper in which you uh, in which you can add a class that is uh, auto mapper class and uh, that is need you mm, auto mapper the name of the auto mapper you decide but that class is inherited from the profile class so must to use any uh, naming conventions like auto mapper profile i have to use auto mapper profile and inherited with the profile and use control dot to resolve the usings create a constructor of the automapper profile and add the uh, view model and the model to each other and you can say map with the view model to map create map okay in which you can add 
both classes that is the module class and the uh, view model class that is a category I have a model class and category view is the view model class okay there is I won't also need to reverse map because I need to category to category view model and also the category view to category model so use also dot to reverse map so both are used uh, in the project and after doing that you can add uh, in some configuration in the startup.cs file okay so open uh, startup.cs file after doing this uh, for all the view model must to add these types of dot create uh, create map in the uh, service config uh, void uh, configuration services method you must to add that types of transactions that is add transaction and i category interface is uh, using to category repository class because i use category repository to uh, as a type of access layer so uh, variable configuration equals to new auto mapper as auto mapper is a class name dot map mapper configuration is use lambda ex expression here cfc configuration and in which you can add that your class is created okay it's too easy to use cfg dot add profile and in which you can add your class that is auto mapper profile new the name of the class is where is auto mapper yeah auto mapper profile and resolve using uh, control dot control dot and resolve this using statements okay that's nice after doing this must to add your configuration object variable mapper equals to then the name of the uh, configuration is config dot create mapper is the mapping is created service dot add singleton is a method uh, in the dependency you can say uh, singleton transaction is scoped so I have need to use add singleton so for the whole applications I have used only the single mapper class so in the singleton you can use and in which you can add the mapper and in the controller section there is a last uh, in the controller section you can use i mapper that is uh, uh, that interface is uh, actually available in the auto mapper class sorry app auto mapper name spaces so i mapper And that mapper is used auto mapper profile as well as your service configuration. So I mapper is actually exist in auto mapper. So use I mapper mapper and in the constructor you can use the mapper I mapper mapper and that mapper is uh, use your class as well as configuration. So before any uh, code you must to use that mapper so underscore context is the name of your uh, repository interface that is underscore context dot get all categories and that mapper class underscore mapper dot map I want to send a list of items so use list 
if you use single item there is no need to use list okay so underscore mapper dot map category view because I want to pass model to view model so use here view model that is the last destination you can use view model and what item you pass that is list that is item and in the view model you can pass that is mapped item that's it thank you very much for watching this video and keep watching my all other videos i'm sure i will provide you better video tutorials as well as at the full details of uh, asp.net core so please please guys uh, don't forget this uh, subscribe my channel and you can check that resolve your codes thank you very much for watching this